Hey, it's DLL and I welcome you. This is a great day and today I have something special for me because, oh look at this, because I have um, German traditional food to test and let's check it out. Don't expect too much, we have convenience food. <laughs> We have Schweine Roulade in würziger Soße mit Kartoffelpüree und Apfel Rotkohl. Äh, kannst du mal Schweine Roulade in würziger Soße mit Kartoffelpüree und Apfel Rotkohl eingeben? So, thanks babe. It says literally a pork roll in spicy sauce with mashed potatoes and red cabbage. And this is how it should look. This is our pork roll, our spicy sauce our red cabbage and the mashed potatoes and it says super duper good for the microwave <laughs> let's check out the calories and here we go you have oh my god just 81 calories per 100 gram this is amazing this is i should eat that stuff every day this is sportive this is really sportive for me let's unbox it first here we go Oh, and I'm so curious, I never ever had this before, but that's all, so here we go. And it says, we have to cut each chamber, and then we have to put it in for approximately 4 minutes, and then we have our menu. So, here we go, keep in mind how this looks, and I would say, let's do the magic trick, otherwise today, so here we go. Ooh. Ta da! <laughs> there we go. This is our food. It looked like astronauts should eat it. Here we go. But it looked like some military ratio. I would say let's check it out. So, here we go. This is our pork roll. And funny thing I mentioned when I was in the kitchen is that the whole stuff. It is stable until 2017 and shelved that long time. This is like military food. This is really cool. So let's go. Let's take out the mashed potato and it's more like some hard stuff. I Oh my god. It doesn't look really good. Maybe I have to... Mix the whole stuff together, maybe it is better then. And let's take a look how it should look and how it does look. Okay, this is okay. Let's check it out. And it's, it tastes like gum. This is so interesting, it tastes like gum. Let's check it out with the sauce. Yeah, then it's better. The sauce is really good in my mind. It's a bit fatty, that's good too. I would say let's check out the pork meat. And normally these pork rolls are filled with uh, cucumbers and other stuff. And this is our pork meat. So hopefully I get it in my mouth. Here we go. And I have to say this is not an option for me <laughs> for an everyday meal. So let's see pork meat. You cannot see much, so... Well, I do not, I do not like it. <laughs> you don't have many flavors in the pork meat. Just this unnatural, stable flavor. Uh, let's check out the red cabbage. Maybe this is the best of the whole package. Here we go. Yeah. As I thought, the red cabbage is really good. This has a really nice flavor. The cabbage is so good. Mm. Mm. But these mashed potatoes, they are so strange. I guess you have to eat them with this sauce. Then it is okay. Mm. I would love to show you more of this meat, but I'm not able to. 
that I'm not really sure if this is real meat. Here we go. Here we can see. I look in the inside. You have some cucumbers and I guess onions and mustard in it and some bacon. Yeah, this is how in German pork rolls are made or filled. Mm. So let's come to a ranking. How many points should I give for this lovely meat which look like this in real? I don't know. Let's give about 5 out of 10. Why 5? Because the whole meat is stable for years. <laughs> Especially the, the pork meat, the pork roll is stable for years. And this is really crazy because meat isn't uh, stable that long. The price is okay. I guess uh, 2 euros for the whole package. And we have a whole portion. You can eat three of them and you might have enough stuff for the day. Maybe I check another one. Uh, maybe I check out another one in the future. Um, yeah, the red cabbage is brilliant, but the rest is shit. So five out of ten. I hope you liked the episode. I have to eat my military ratio. <laughs> See you next time. I love you all. Your HTLL. Bye bye. Really, 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 really much of them. And I'd say let's check it out first the smell and then the taste. And interestingly, the flavor is just like normal lemon iced tea, but we have black tea.